good afternoon ma'am and good afternoon ma uh, dear students my dear friends i am going to take seminar on mathematics textbook i am anish jabba and i am doing my b.ed in saint ignatius college of education now let us see what are the content i have included in mathematics textbook we are going to see the introduction then we are going to see about the basics about mathematics textbook then need for mathematics textbook and its characteristics and then, then we are going to conclude it introduction the mathematics textbook is an important source for learning mathematics and it plays a key role in the effective teaching and learning process yes mathematics textbooks is a source it is a source for learning mathematics and it plays a key that is important role in effective teaching and learning process mathematics textbook should provide problem solving techniques and approaches the main purpose and goal of math textbook is to develop problem solving and critical thinking skills among the students it should develop all the type of critical thinking analysis and synthetic thinking among the students next let us see the basic of the basis or the introduction about the mathematics textbook a mathematics textbook plays an important role in teaching and learning as we already saw a mathematics textbooks always plays an important role in teaching and learning even in understanding other subjects we need mathematics and uh, for attaining clarity we need mathematics textbook it represents a useful resource for both teachers and students as a course designers now let us see what are the needs for mathematics textbooks for teachers first we are going to see the need of mathematics for teachers a math textbook is written according to the syllabus and gives a outline of the course thus it helps the teacher to decide about the depths of the content to be presented to the students so it helps the student to be systematic and to draw the outline of the course and it helps in attaining the in depth concept about the content to be presented to the students also a textbook provide an insight to the teacher in planning the lesson in selecting the problems to be worked out the method of teaching to be adopted and the teaching aids to be used also most textbooks are written by most experienced teachers of mathematics so in handling textbooks we need most experienced teachers the need for mathematics textbook for teachers is that they need to get an insight they need to get an outline of the lesson to be taught that's why mathematics textbooks is very essential for teachers also the logical and psychological sequence followed in a textbooks help the teachers in presenting the subject matter in an orderly and systematic sequence in each standard everything is followed in Uh, orderly sequence a good textbook presents a variety of worked examples on each topic so it helps the teachers to continue with the exercise problems now let us see what are the need for the mathematics te textbooks for students mathematics textbooks for students helps the pupils to relate what they are learning to life what they are what they are learning in the classroom is applied in their life so that mathematics textbooks is very essential Also the mathematics textbook provides important source of materials for reviewing and recapitulating the lessons taught in the class so when they when, when they learn something in the classroom they need to recapitulate when they are in their homes so that mathematics textbooks helps them with this purpose a lot for the student also it provides adequate materials for drill and practice as already said what they learn in the classroom must be applied in life and must be recapitulated then we have to go for drill and necessary practice and this help helps in fixing the mathematical concept principles and formula in the mind of the students it encourages self study and independent work among the students now let us see what are the characteristics of a mathematics textbook the appearance of the mathematics textbook should be appealing with an attractive cover page the cover page should be appealing first of all then it should be of latest edition edition with necessary modification and it should be moderately priced so that everyone can get it also it should be in accordance with the aims and objectives of teaching maths it should be in accordance with the aims and objectives so that they reach the goal what they set in a particular standard of classroom of for teaching mathematics it should provide for individual differences there are mm, there are various kinds of children and those who are 
very gifted and uh, those who are average learners and uh, slow learners so the mathematics textbook should provide according to the individual differences among the students there should be sufficient provision provision for revision practice and review the content presented in the textbook should be organized accurate and up to date it should be most importantly up to date and updated the content should be organized in the increasing order of difficulty and it should go from simple to complex the content of the textbook should have a direct practical social and utility values the answers given at the back side should be very approximate very very accurate and correct conclusion thus we have come to the conclusion that the mathematics textbook is one of the most important sources of teaching and learning process it can be rightly said as the framework or guide for the purpose of learning mathematics i have given some references here about i have shared what i have referred and okay we have referred from the www.slideshare.net wikipedia.org and sciencedirect.com cambridge.org and springer.com Thank you.